Monday morning coffee. How are you guys doing? Hope you're doing great. Uh, it's been a very funky week. And you know, one thing that I like is um, just to talk about something positive. Can you hear me? Can you hear me good? I'm not sure if like people can hear me. Let me see. Uh, it's been a very funky week. There you go. Now I know that you can hear me for sure. So what, like, and I want to talk about the subject, which I think is really, really important because uh, gratitude is so, so, so important for actually whatever is happening in your life gratitude is is at the forefront of everything and um and i mean that you didn't hear you you didn't hear me really uh talking about this this week because i you know i want to i want always want to stay into the positive thing but i think it's very important that i bring that up right now because it's um it's gonna help me to make my point um, for some of you that do not know, my mom passed last week, actually on Monday last week, uh, after I did my Monday morning coffee, received a phone call and, uh, and was just like, yeah, uh, she transmuted her energy to next phase of her life. And it's nothing to do with what's happening right now. Uh, she was, you know, she was fighting some health issues and and she left like you know in peace and at the right place and uh and i had a call with her the day prior and uh and i remember that i was talking with her and my daughter was talking with her and uh and she was she looked so happy she looked so happy and I'm really really proud about her uh her granddaughter and what what she was doing and you know that the, they have this in the eye, uh, our parents and um, like the, the feeling we have for our children and the pride that we have for our children. Well, our parents has the same for their grandchildren. So she had that and it was very interesting to, to see. And I remember I hung up and I was like, hmm. Because the message that she transmitted to my my daughter was was somehow almost like a goodbye thing, and and during the weekend this weekend I was just like I woke up one morning and I was just like mm, I would like to, maybe maybe I should call my mom like that came just like out of nowhere, and I was just oh wow I'm not gonna be able to do that anymore. So this is where the subject of gratitude is very, very important. Hi, Natasha. Because gratitude is about celebrating everything that you have in your life right here, right now. And celebrating everything that you want to have in your life. And when you are in a state of gratitude, and I mean, you probably heard that hundreds of times you heard like celebrity talking about how grateful they are you heard um if you've been to the church you heard like uh, in some of the scriptures that you need to be grateful if you uh have been like you know there's there's this gratitude but i think we take it for granted we're really taking everything that we have for granted we're not realizing how powerful how important how important it is to be into the states of gratitude all the time. And when we do, when we do feel into the states of gratitude all the time, 
you cannot you cannot have any other thing than gratitude into your experience and that is what really gratitude is all about it is so powerful it's it's going to magnetize everything which you have around you it's going to magnetize this and bring all this into your experience so and i was reading because my my sister is a little bit better into a like post of like you know she did a beautiful post like in uh, put picture of her and, and my mom and uh, like one of the picture i was on it and i mean she had i don't know like 300 messages or something like that and she was really good to um like to to express you know what what our mom meant to us and i mean our mom was like like a rock but she was really really strong and was able like to to brought some great values uh into our life my sisters and and me and one of the person that wrote one of the common like a common friend we have my sister and i she wrote that you know i was just seeing my mom and i saw her differently because now she knows someone that lost their mom now all of a sudden like she has a better appreciation and this is what the state of gratitude is she has a better appreciation of what she has in her life and that is what you have to do but all the time don't wait for losing something or have an experience of loss before that you're starting appreciating what you have and that's what gratitude is gratitude is taking the time and connect and and stop and really give thanks give thanks for everything that you have currently give thanks for the beauty that you have in your life give thanks for the roof that you have over your your head give thanks for the health that you're having and right now into this special situation well it's the time to give thanks even more because a little bit of our freedom and our freedom of movement being able to travel being able like to get together uh is been promoted right now to not do that and we went to see we went to a coffee place and see some some friends here and and people are scared to they're scared to odd they're scared to give hand, like handshakes and all those things it's just like what like now because because of what's happening now like we 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 really we're going to take distance between us human being which really what we are we are social beings so i'm having i want to say i'm having a hard time actually i'm 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 not going to i'm not going to do that like my mom just passed so we all going to die that is a fact okay at some points we all going to die so do you want to live in fear for the rest of your life and and like not seeing people and when you see people like you see like you know disease walking around and being scared of everybody and everything and not like touch people or touch something that someone touch or you want to live fully happy grateful connected having contact having meaningful relationship and and connection and then when it's time to go it's time to go what do you want because i am not going to abide by living into that fear i refuse that is not that is not where i am i believe that if we are grateful if we are living into this beautiful world we should be able like to connect and express and and feel um that's the world that I want to live in so be grateful be grateful now for everything that you have in your life because it it can be gone just like that and then when it is gone then you're going to say oh i wish i would have like woulda coulda shoulda right be grateful now 
be into the state of gratitude of everything that you're having and and make sure that that is something that you're practicing every single day because again it can go and you're not going to have the time to say goodbye or to to really realize how good you had it and the only way that you can really full feel and live fully present is if you are into the state of gratitude all the time all the time nonstop without without yeah without rest you need to be grateful so i want to share my gratitude for you that you took the time to listen to this um share like uh put a comment as well are you going to live into this state of fear or you want to live into a state of gratitude and share with the people that you love and and um and continue to make those human connection because four or five months ago that disease was around all around us and you were not scared of it so what changed think about it i'm grateful to you and i wish you a spectacular spectacular week bye bye